Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we will be solving round 954 mathematical problem. You are given a string of length more than 1 consisting of digits 0 to 9. You must insert exactly n minus 2 symbols either plus or multiplication and then after finding the arithmetic result of your equation that you made you need to return the minimum possible result okay now since you need to perform n minus 2 symbols that means any one number from your made numbers will have to be a two digit number if you have n digits and you have to insert n minus 1 symbols in between that means you can insert n minus 1 symbols in the gaps but since you need to insert n minus 2 then you will need one two digit string now since the constraints are very less we can directly brute force the value through every possible double length string like if you have a string having n is equal to 5 that means at your first operation you will find a value keeping your first two digits as your two digit number in your second operation you will choose these two digits in your third operation these two fourth operation these two and then after calculating the answer for every possible you return the minimum now how do you find the answer such that the answer is as minimum as possible now if you have two symbols multiplication and addition it is easy to see that by addition you will always get a smaller answer but in some cases you might prefer multiplication like if you have zero multiplicating by zero will give you the minimum possible answer and hence you should use multiplication every time you encounter a zero and if you encounter a, a one then it is also easy to see that multiplying by one gives a lesser answer than adding by one okay now i'll show you how you should construct your answer now suppose you are finding an answer keeping these two digits as your double digit number and you have some digits ahead and behind and you need to find the minimum possible answer keeping these as your double digit number then you will iterate ahead and behind whenever you come across a number that is more than or equal to 2 that means it is always good if you add and not multiply so you will always add but if you encounter 0 or 1 you will always multiply okay if you encounter 0 ahead or behind that means it's easy to see that you can directly print 0 and return from your function because that is going to be your minimum answer okay now i'll show you how how to implement this okay first of all this loop will consider all pairs from 0 to n minus 1 i and i plus 1 is my currently two digit pair i find what is the value of my two digit pair and then i iterate behind and iterate ahead if i find zero i directly print zero and if i find a number more than equal to two i add it if i find one i don't need to do anything because multiplication by one gives us the same answer now if this number is one that means it would be a good choice to multiply this num and not add it so if you have something in 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 your value of sum and your num is equal to one that means this is directly your answer else you will perform an addition operation with num and sum and num will be your minimum possible answer keeping i and i plus 1 as your two digit number 
after that this loop continues for all possible two digit pairs of i and then the answer stores the minimum of all the possible pairs okay thank you guys for watching make sure to like share and subscribe the video to never miss another tutorial